In this tutorial, we're going to simulate a cylindrical heat source using ANSYS Fluent software. By clicking on the subscribe button, you will be informed about the newest CFD training videos by Mr. CFD. Or if you are watching the training video, click on the Mr. CFD logo and subscribe. Now to define the heat generation rate inside our model, expand cell zone conditions, go over solid, expand it again, and then double click on source term button. There are two ways to check that your simulation process have reached convergence or not. Alongside checking the residuals reaching and nearing zero, you may define an arbitrary report or an arbitrary boundary in order to calculate different parameters like pressure, velocity, temperature, and see whether they reach a constant value or not. If yes, it may be a sign that your simulation process have reached convergence. However, you must check the residuals as well. To create such report, you can simply right-click on Report Definitions, go over New, and select one of the options available based on your simulation. Now to for example extract the path line of our airflow, just right click on path lines and then click on new. And finally in this slide you can see the path lines of our airflow entering our computational domain, passing over our heat source and then exiting our computational domain. Finally, a summary of different settings and setup that we have used in our project is presented to you in the slide. Obtain the mesh file and also the full training movie by purchasing this product. To benefit from Mr. CFD services, including simulation, consultation, and training, contact our experts via info at mrcfd.com.